Hello everybody, it's Amel, and today I'm going to show you how to solve the first unique character in a string problem. It says, given a string, find the first non-repeating character in it and return its index. If it doesn't exist, return negative 1. Examples, here, s equals leak code. The method returns 0 because the first unique character is at index 0, the L. As you can see, the L is unique and it is the first character in the string that is unique. So we return its index, 0. Here, example 2, the method returns 2, 0, 1, 2, V, because V is the first unique character in the string. So, um, it says, you may assume the string contain only lowercase letters. So how can we solve this problem? We can solve this problem using a hash map. We use the hash map to, to store the count of every letter. And then, after we get the count for every letter, then we can go through the string from left to right. And when we find a character that has count as one, then we know that that is the first non-repeating character. That is the first unique character in the string. So the hash map allows you to store key value pairs. We're going to store each character as a key and its count will be the value. So without further ado, I'm going to show you how to write the code. First, I'm going to check if s equals equals null or s dot length equals equals zero return negative one. So if the pointer is null, the reference is null or the string is empty, return negative 1 to indicate that there's no unique character. Then as I said, I'm going to have a map from character to integer map. Gets a value of new hash map. So I'm going to store each character in its count. So I have to go through the string. I'm going to say for char c in s dot to char array I'm gonna say map dot put c map dot get or default c zero plus one so here what I'm doing is that I iterate through the input string from left to right whenever I see a character I put the count of the character the first time, if it is not in the map, then I use this method get or default that's going to give me 0, and 0 plus 1 is 1. So the first time, c will be 1. If I see c again, it's going to get the count that it had before, and it's going to add 1 to this. So by the end of the iteration, this map will contain every letter and the count for that letter. So now that I know how many times each character appears, I can go through the string from left to right again. So I can say for integer i gets a value of 0. i is less than s dot length plus plus i. Then I can say if map dot get s dot char at i, if what you get if the count equals 1, then you know that this must be the first unique character, so you can return its index, which is i. If you are able to, if you don't find that, if there's no unique character, you return negative 1 at the end to indicate that you were not able to find a unique character in the string. So I'm going to run the code. It seems to be working fine, so the solution. All right, this is working perfectly. So the time complexity is big O of n, where n is the length of the string. You know that the hash map has constant time lookup, so we can find um, the count in constant time. Uh, please press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and see you next time.